And overall, we have over 130,000 transit rides per day. The vast, vast majority of those rides are completely safe. We also have uniformed personnel who are, who are approachable and they want to help. So I would say if you're feeling unsafe or uneasy and you're, you're just needing some extra support, please reach out and talk to our teams. They are there for you. They are on site throughout the network. You can approach our transit operators, our inspectors, security guards, transit peace officers, as well as EPS. They're also supported by almost 4,000 different security surveillance cameras and our 24 seven control center staff is looking after all of us as we use transit. We are ready to respond and we wanna be there for people to help. Partners, these issues that are causing a lot of the concerns and the feelings of uh, feeling unsafe are much, much bigger than transit. And that honestly is what keeps me up at night. It's the most difficult part of all of this is that we're talking about really broad social issues, people who are without uh, housing solutions, people who are suffering from addictions and mental health challenges, and they are congregating in our spaces. So from a human centered perspective, how do we ensure that all of us as riders are safe, all of our staff and contractors are safe, and that we're also providing the appropriate supports for people.